We are here with Aaron Morrison, Vincent, and Chris Grebner from the Lively and West Branch. Welcome. Hi. Thank you. Thank you for, for being us. here. We were just talking while Corey was wrapping up with weather. It's so exciting to know that there's a supper club around. Yeah. Yes. I love supper clubs. Tell us about you guys. All right. Well, the supper Rock, club. Rock paper scissors. Yeah, <laughs> exactly. Go first. Um, the supper club is uh, right now. It's once a month, mm -hmm. um, the first Friday of the month, uh, where we have an opportunity to work with all of the farmers and producers in our area. Um, it's it's a smaller seating, so we we seat about 30 people, and it's a multi-course dinner. Um, and the goal really is to for us to be a little more intentional about the menu, who we're working with and uh, give people a longer dining experience. Yeah, So, and it's fun. Just the name yeah. is fun, Supper yeah. Club. Erin, you guys do a lot of different things mm -hmm. at the Lively. Tell us more about that, too. Yeah, so first and foremost, we are a private event space. So we do rehearsals there. We do baby showers and bridal showers um, and class reunions, stuff like that. Um, we are actually located next to Little Lights on the Lane, which mm. is our wedding and event venue. Um, and we've been open for about five years there, five okay. years actually okay. this year. So when we had the opportunity to be able to open a restaurant next door to be able to cater to our couples um, and also got the opportunity to work with Chris, <laughs> who's incredibly talented, we, it was a no-brainer for us. So we get to do smaller events, but then also be open for the restaurant a couple of days a week. So it's definitely more intentional hours. We're mm -hmm. open on Thursday evenings. We're open on some select Wednesdays and Fridays, like tomorrow for ladies' night. Oh, great, yes. Um, and then we have Sunday brunch in, which has become very popular. I'm so. sure it has. Farm to table is such a popular phrase and such a popular thing right now in the restaurant industry. Tell me a little bit about what you guys are making and how it all fits into that. Yeah, so um, we we really, I, I mean, it's one of the things that I um, enjoy the most about what we do and, mm -hmm. and what I get to do and um, is working closely with the farms. We've, we work closely with Ecollective, Forrest Kelly, um, uh, Sarah at uh, Seven Branches mm -hmm. is a new farmer mm -hmm. to me. She's just outside of West Branch. Um, and uh, to be able to work with people who uh, care about the product as much as we do, um, who work so very hard to have some of the best products in, in Eastern Iowa, mm -hmm. um, and, and uh, t to be also to be able to work uh, and get to change the menu six or seven times a year mm -hmm. and, and uh, uh, it, it keeps us, it a little more interesting for us. And yes, you get to put your artistry on display exactly, more often. Yeah. So what are you making now? So these two dishes that I'm just going to finish here are the, uh, the sausage campanelle mm. uh, with kale pesto, some Calabrian chilies, and uh, Parmesan. And the other dish is um, our fried pork chop with... Uh, I know, it looks so good. <laughs> Um, for those of you watching at home, you're wondering, well, why does he have a towel on the cooktop? We have an induction cooktop, so the only part that's getting hot is the is part that Chef is stirring right that's now. Right. Yes. So hold your calls, hold your letters. We know what we're doing, especially Chef. Well, she, yes, Chef, chef knows what he's doing. Chris right. knows, we don't, but this looks so delicious. Yeah, thanks. And so if people want to come, they can get tickets to the Supper Club. How do yes. they do that? Just on the website? Yes, that's all done on the website. Um, April is almost sold out. Mm -hmm. Um, and we're trying to, uh, come May, we'll do, I think it's May, we'll do yep. two a month. Okay. Um, uh, first Friday and third Friday or something like yep. that. So yep. it's all on the website. What's some of the standard fare? I mean, obviously you're talking about being able to expand the menu Whoa. and do neat things. <laughs> yeah. But what are some of the, the old uh, standards that you guys have on there? So these two dishes are on our standard dinner menu. Okay. Um, as well as the crowd favorites, we have a... Uh, uh, proper smash burger on the menu. I saw pictures. Yeah, that we, looks like a good smash burger. We have a um, fried chicken sandwich on the menu. Typically, you know, a couple of pastas. So, okay. Um, there's a steak. Yep, a yep. steak. Mm -hmm. um, so, yeah, there's always a little bit of something mm -hmm. for everybody. Are you having a steak dinner on Friday night, or what is happening on yep, Friday? We have fish this weekend, too. So okay. there's not just steak. It's our full menu, but we do have some steak and fish specials this Friday. Okay. And that's one of our select Fridays. So um, we're not open every Friday because we have rehearsal dinners sometimes, mm -hmm. or we have our supper club. So really just paying attention to our Instagram. We, we do a post saying, like, this is what's happening this week and then go into our website for the tickets, or you can buy those on Instagram, too. And 
The Supper Club is, it's my favorite part. I love uh, Thursday and Sundays, but there's something so magical about it. Like you show up and everybody's jittery because they mm -hmm. don't know each other. Mm -hmm. And by the end of the evening, they're laughing and they've become friends and they stay way longer than it was supposed <laughs> to be, which is great. Um, but to be able to come and Chris comes out after each course and talks about it, mm -hmm. and it's just so fun to hear about where it was sourced from and how he's made it, and we have, we just have a really energetic and happy, lively team as yes, well. Yes, I so, hope so. It's in the name. Yes, it's well, in the name. <laughs> we're going to take a break here. When we come back, we'll kind of get a final look at the, at the finished product. In the meantime, where can people find you guys and get more info? Yep, so we're actually out by Little Lights on the Lane, so it's just off of Herbert Hoover Highway um, in West Branch. This is a little bit from downtown, just about five minutes, okay. so if they if they Google that, they'll find us. Amazing. Yep. It smells so good. I'm going to try it all. We're going to take a break. We'll wrap.